Honestly, I was a little scared in the beginning. It was going to be a two-week journey all by myself. But the first few of zero really changed all of that for me. I was really happy to be here. Zero is a beautiful place. It's a small valley with some vibrant paddy fields in the middle of mountains, hills. and some unpredictable rains The festival is pretty different too. It's a great mix of upcoming talent playing some real music for four days. That and some local rice beer usually makes up a great night at zero. My next stop was Meghalaya. True to its name, you do find some insane clouds in Meghalaya. It's hard not to stop and take in all that beauty. The roads here are so inviting. Makes you want to travel more. When the roads are moving, my thoughts are completely silent, and that's a good feeling. In this misty and sleepy state of Meghalaya, there's a view everywhere you look. Far away from societies, it's peaceful. The waters, the fresh air, the lovely clouds, and the lush green mountains make you feel connected back to nature, and that gives me a much-needed break from the rush of everyday life. I have to admit, looking at those dark clouds move became one of the most interesting parts of my day. I'll ever meet again. And no, it wasn't scary, but was life-changing for sure.